Good morning. Today is Friday, February 10th. Welcome to the AMHS Morning News. My name is Arden Lloyd. And my name is Jennifer Sixtos. Here are your morning announcements. Due to an overwhelming amount of noise, dirty dishes, and disrespect of the space of the food room will be closed during both lunches for the remainder of the week. Students will not be allowed to use the microwave until further notice. If there is any girls that want to come out for track, the last day is today. You must have a physical on file or you can't practice until you have one. If you have any questions, please contact Coach Brazel in room B18. If you are, have not purchased your 2016 and 2017 yearbook, please see Ms. Scott for order forms. Seniors, if you would like to put a quote in the yearbook, please see Ms. Scott. The deadline is March 3rd. The History Club will be selling Valentine Day themed Rice Krispie treats during both lunches this week. They are only $2 a piece and will have your personal note attached. There will be red ones for love, pink ones for I like you, and yellow for friends. They will be hand delivered on Valentine's Day during EOB. Crimson Express Color Guard will have an open gym on the following dates in the gym in McElveen, February 13th. Tryouts will be held on February 22nd and 23rd. Location to be announced. Key club petitions for class directors are now available on A67. If you missed last week's meeting, please stop by A67 to pick up some important information and check sign-ups. FBLA is, cr is selling crush cans during both lunches for $1. You can also send a personal message with each can you purchase. Cans will be delivered during ELP on Valentine's Day, Tuesday, February 14th. We would like to wish a happy birthday to Gina Kellogg. For lunch today, we will be having tacos or pizza, refried beans, corn, fresh or mixed fruit. Today's weather is sunny and windy with a high of 56 degrees and a low of 50 degrees. Jackson CEO is a program where young entrepreneurs can meet together and speak to other business owners and learn how to own and run their own business. We meet with business owners and they, some of them give us tours of their businesses, that's really cool, and most of them will come in with like a prepared speech, but others will be cool and just sit down and let us talk to them and kind of grill them about what they've done with their life and how that's gone. It is very experience based. The students that take part in the class, they actually will start fully functioning real businesses where real profits, real money changes hands. Try to have 50 to 60 guest speakers a year and some of those come to us and share their experiences and tell their stories. And then other times we go to them and we get to tour many different local area businesses. It helped me get a clear picture of my future. Being able to help the community and keep businesses local. Holding a strong network of local business owners. The speakers have taught me that it's okay to fail and continue failing because that's when you really learn. We are professionals. We are Jackson CEO. Now everyone please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.